So, here we are again. Another horror game. I don't know why you guys keep throwing these at me. I never get scared by them. I have never once been scared by a horror game. There's no proof that that has ever happened. Robin, can you please put in a spook from this or I get scared? <laughs> Which is inevitably going to happen. Oh, but I accept the challenge. You guys have told me that this game is so scary, so mind-bendingly horrifying that I'm going to end up in a ball on the floor, covered in my own juices, naked, on the phone to my mother, asking to crawl back into the womb. But I think... You guys are full of nonsense. I think you're big babies who can't handle your horror. Well, let's get in, shall we? Error 54. What is this even all about? What is error 54? What does that entail? Low brightness recommends. Low brightness. <laughs> oh, God. Is that me? Why am I on the floor? Very slowly taking control of my character. Apparently the camera is on top of my head, not in my head. So I am very short. It's true to life then. Flashlight. Good start. I was going to continue, G, to add item to inventory. Nice. It's always good when you start off with a flashlight. I like that. I appreciate when games do that. Whoa. Why am I getting like really strong PT vibes from this? <laughs> Why are the boards squeaking? Somebody put some oil on this floor. I need to change my sensitivity. Good lord. Is there a point to this? Is there gonna be anything in these? Okay, that radio is driving me insane. I gotta move. Wait, is this like PT? Oh my god, it is. I'm in the same hallway again. It's a PT game! <gasps> I didn't know that. I love PT. Everything's backwards. Can I turn off the radio though? Maybe one of these times through the radio will go off. Okay. Hopefully one of the times through this, the boards will be less squeaky as well. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> oh, I don't like it. I don't also don't like how unbelievably loud the radio is because if something wants to sneak up on me, it's very easy! Oh, you're open for the first time. I thought I heard breathing. Oh. Cozy. Uh, and I'm to inventory. Hell yeah! Okay. Light the fire. Throw the lantern in there. Cybercrime, the latest news for today. A dangerous virus has rapidly captured hundreds of thousands of devices around the world. American telecommunications company Jane Freak has warned us, uh, has warned users about the active spreading of malicious software called number 54. Oh, it's a virus. The virus has infected hundreds of thousands of computers and this number is growing exponentially. Information security experts claim that this virus collects all possible information about the user and transmits it to the creator. London and Washington accuse Russia of spreading the virus. The dang Russians are at it again! Spreading viruses on our systems? Okay. So I gotta watch out for a virus. That's pretty easy. Just put antivirus on your software. On your uh, computer. Or is this like a super virus that bypasses it? I want to light the fire. Oh. Just keep going. Keep going. Past the squeaky doors. Wait, if it's a computer... Oh, that's me. See, it's scary because the computers are the... Camera's on top of my head! Put it in my head, and then I won't hear myself breathe as much. I'm not afraid of a computer virus.
Did the computer virus do that? Is the computer virus capable of turning off the lights and turning off the radio? I don't know if there's ever actually going to be anything in these and I'm checking for no bloody reason. Okay! I am compliant! Was that me? I don't know if that's me breathing. I mean, I'd hope I'm breathing. Oh. oh, that's so much darker. Is that darker than the last time? <laughs> I can't see because there's lights blinding me in the face. Hold on. I still can't see anything. <laughs> oh, stop breathing. Oh. <sighs> Dude, calm down. You sound like you're about to have an asthma attack. I'm gonna close that. You know in horror movies when you walk- they walk into a room, the door closes behind them and everyone's like, Ah! God! Scary! That's very comforting to me. I like having the door closed behind me because that means nothing can like sneak in without me knowing. That or I'm trapped in here with a demon. <laughs> oh, I do not like your timing. I got keys to something! Oh, and I have feet! Oh, that's excellent! Who goes there? Ah, uh, occupied! I'm pooping! Oh, they opened it for me. Thank you. Who's out here? See that? That was a military tactic. Putting your back against the wall so no one can sneak up on you. I learned that from my cat. <laughs> oh, the radio is gone. Was this shadow just because I walked around the corner? Get out of there! <laughs> I know we're going straight back into it, but that version of it was bad. Hated. It's just one hallway. It's just a hallway. What can a hallway do to you? Where's the radio gone? I kind of miss it now. Oh, God. Should I be going back in here? Oh. Ouch. Stop doing that. In the city of Portland, residents reported the loss of a well-known video blogger. Oh, no! Those people are our saviors! Having on the channel more than 100,000 subscribers, on the channel blogger shared how to fix... <laughs> on the channel blogger shared how to fix various system errors and get rid of viruses. It is known that the blogger at the time of the kidnapping was at home and filmed another video tutorial and even managed to save the file called How to Fix Number 54 System Error. The search has already begun. Oh, you're not going to do something to my computer, are you? Oh. I'm not an edge. That paper was just really loud. Oh, where's my door gone? It is I, video blogger! <laughs> Oh, I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. Close the door. Close the door behind you. Stay in here forever. We're not going. I don't care who's out there. I am video blogger. I'm staying in here. Got a hundred, a couple hundred thousand on my blogger site. I don't need to be doing anything. I've made it. No, I'm in a tiny boy jail. Oh, there's a train in my head. Why am I here on a train? Oh man, it's all changing. Why? Why indeed? I ask that question all the time with two hands raised. 
Why? <laughs> oh, I'm gonna turn around at some point and something's gonna be there. Oh my god, the levels change so dynamically. This is amazing. Big long hallway, always sprint through it. Oh no, 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 no. <laughs> Who goes there? I'll say bad things about you on my video blogger site. You'll get cancelled so hard. Okay. We're out of one mess into another. You just gotta handle life like one mess at a time. It's never about having a plan. Do I look like the kind of guy who has a plan? Shut up, shut up, shut up. Ugh. Ugh. I still don't know how a computer virus is doing all of this. That they hack the building. That scared the life out of me. I'm getting out here. Oh no, oh no, oh no! <laughs> oh, I hate this! Look behind you, I don't want to! Does that count? <laughs> okay. Oh. Well, that's not that scary. <gasps> Me oh my. <laughs> you wanna play? How about hide and seek? You're hiding. It actually says you're hitting. Okay, okay, I'm hitting. I'm hitting. I'm really good at hitting. Uh, cybercrime, the latest news for today. Epidemic of dangerous computer virus moves to a new level. Yesterday, the virus name number 54 sees all the electronic billboards in Tokyo and demonstrated the starting inscription, you are next. Startling inscription. To save the city from an inscription could only one way power off. Uh, the damage caused by the most massive cyber attack is estimated at tens of millions of dollars. The city authorities are furious. As they should be. Oh, this is a future I do not want to live in. Does this technically count as him cyberbullying me? Oh no, this turned into a completely different game all of a sudden. It's okay, I can find my way out. I'm good at this. I'm smart. Sprint everywhere so the enemy knows your position. That's real big brain tactics, oh god. Oh, now I don't know where I've been! Oh, I'm not good at this! Okay, give me a head start! Oh, a light. That's a good sign. That terrible sign. Where's the bloody exit? Are the walls changing? What if I just go back the way I came? I'm doing it. Screw this. Okay, I'm not doing it. Screw that. Okay, it's fine. It's just a very scary man running after me in a basement. <sighs> Bro! Get yourself a Ventolin inhaler or something! Look, I have asthma too! But you don't hear me going around freaking myself out all the time. I do, constantly. Oh my god, where is the exit? <gasps> exit! That was not there before. I checked here! Me big smart. Who? Oh! Who is it? The number 54 virus is the biggest threat to the global economy. Over the past two days, hundreds of millions of people have complained about their banks for stolen money and completely zeroed out cash accounts. The damage is estimated at more than 10 billion dollars. 
As strange as it may sound, many now do not advise to use the internet at all because of Virus 54. Oh, this is a future that some other people are going to live in. This isn't going to happen in my lifetime. But one day... Excuse me, none of your doors open. None of your doors open and I don't want to retread the same ground! Ah! Leave this place. Or should I say... Leave this place. No! Oh, ho, ho, ho. Ah! Oh, I wanted to get a look at him and now I regret it! Oh, please! 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 What was I supposed to do? Oh, crap. Oh, I'm back here again. But why? No, no, the door's open! What am I supposed to do? Oh! God dang it! Get out of there! Oh, got tiny keys! Where's my light off? Get really tired of your nonsense! Okay. I gotta look for keys real fast. God, are the keys here somewhere? Hello? Oh, I hate it. 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 What do I do? What am I? What do I do? I got the key. I got the key. Get out! Ah! <laughs> oh, he was right on me. <laughs> that was a war cry. Let me out! No! Ah! You! No! Is that it? I got the virus, guys. Okay, well, I've had my heart attack for today. <laughs> I'm so glad that you were all here to witness that. Oh, man! That was good. I like that a lot. Very simple, like, premise and setup. Very PT-ish, but... There's a reason that PT is so well revered because it was amazing. So anything that kind of emulates stuff like that, it's just always kind of going to be good. And I like the idea that a computer virus can get sentience and get bigger and stronger and then take over the world and then somehow become manifest and kill me. Though I don't like dying. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this. Feel free to recommend any other good horror games that I might have missed over the last couple of years in the comments. And don't forget to like the video.